2 to 5 percent of the population has untreated or residual amblyopia. Conventional methods of treating amblyopia are refraction, patching and penalization of the better eye with atropine. Various studies have shown a residual amblyopia in more than a third of the cases. The treatment is slow, prolonged and failure is due to non-compliance and social stigmas. It is ineffective in adults. Amblyopia is recognized as a binocular problem and the new treatment modalities aim at treating both eyes together. Brain is neuroplastic and can be trained even in adults. Dicoptic therapy is now emerging as an effective option in the treatment of amblyopia. In dicoptic therapy, a contrast-adjusted stimulus is presented to each eye, with the better eye getting the stimulus with reduced contrast. It promotes development of binocular vision by reducing inhibitory interactions and suppression within the ocular dominance column. Our study on dicoptic therapy with residual amblyopes showed excellent gain in visual acuity and stereopsis. Our award-winning poster at 2018 AIOC clearly showed the efficacy of dicoptic therapy in adults and even eccentric fixators. Binox now offers this dicoptic anti-suppression therapy in the form of games. The better eye receives weak, noisy signals as compared to the amblyopic eye. With progressive improvement in visual acuity, the games can be made more difficult with control on the size, speed and crowding of the stimuli. There are different games with a scoring system for better patient engagement and compliance. Binox also has a program for management of computer vision syndrome. About 3 billion people around the world use internet, with India alone having close to 500 million of them. From children to adults, almost everyone uses mobile phones, laptops or computers. Digital eye strain or computer vision syndrome is an epidemic today. It is so common to have a patient like Shashank in our clinics complaining of headache, eye strain, difficulty in focusing after working on computers. Shashank has 20-20 vision with a normal tear film. Study by Amit Shepard and James Wolfson published in British Medical Journal clearly shows that 50% of CVS patients have focusing issues with weakness in accommodation and vergences. Binox offers quick diagnostic tests for the measurement of heterophorias, amplitude of accommodation, accommodative facility, divergence and convergence. It also offers therapeutic options which can be done in the clinic or home-based. Traditional methods of orthoptic evaluation involved the use of synaptophore, prism bars, flippers, aperture ruler and bernaloscope. The armamentarium was bulky and involved expensive equipments. Binocular vision assessment has now been digitalized. Binox offers the worth four dot test with measurement of suppression scotoma, logma vision chart, Pelly Robson chart for contrast vision, saccadic eye movements, smooth pursuits, measurement of an isoconia, measurement and development of perceptual skills like visual memory and quantitative diplopia charting. A comprehensive report is generated which can be printed or mailed to the patient.